Let's pull the carry piece. It's six in a row. I think we've got one more shot. What to do with it? I guess we'll just, uh, Get ourselves another target. Seven in a row. <clears throat> so this is the Sig Sauer P938. There you can see how small it is relative to my hand. There you can actually see ruler to see its length. So you saw I was not the quickest on the draw. I've not uh, practiced drawing from the holster much at all. Uh, you see it's not an ambi safety. Lots of the SIG P238s and P938s, the 9mm version. The, this, the 238, is 380 ACP. Lots of them are uh, ambidextrous. This particular one is not. So more suitable for me as a left-hander would be uh, one with an ambidextrous safety. Um, but in any case, Pleased to have hit uh, six in a row, and then one more. Six plus one is what this uh, particular carry piece offers. So it's good that it uh, fired right off the bat without a hiccup. Let's uh, use, that was uh, hollow points, by the way, loaded in that. Um, let's just shoot some ball ammo now. Fioki. I only loaded five shots since there are five plates up at the moment. And I'm that confident I will uh, hit them all, right? I guess so. This time I've loaded six. Let me put it on safe. Again, this is not a good deal, uh, not being an ambi. Let me go uh, outside to inside. And missed one. Once again, I'll try outside to inside. This time starting on the right. Left two standing that time. Deep six o'clock hold, I think, is what this uh, gun requires. Uh, maybe I'm shooting a little too low. Put it on safe. Take it off safe. I'll just go straight across, right to left. That's better. How about left to right this time? Nice. Take a pause here about halfway through our shooting. This is uh, what the gun looks like locked open. Notice the barrel tilts up a little bit. Um, that's That tilt down gives a better angle uh, for the feed ramp. More reliable feeding, I take it, is what that uh, lifted barrel is all about when the slide's back. Let me try that outside to inside again, since that seemed to be giving me trouble before. And let me practice with the safety. Ha! Missed the last two in the center. Uh, 
All right, from outside, inside. <laughs> Once again, this time just one. Only have enough rounds here to try that one more time. Safe. And there it is, outside to inside, finally, six in a row. That's how it's done. The Sig Sauer P238. This is a heavy duty version, that's what the HD stands for. This is actually called the HDW. Uh, I think the plain HD has black grips, this one has uh, rosewood grips. It's called heavy duty because the frame is steel. Same material as the slide, rather than an aluminum frame. So it's a little heavier, a little more durable, I guess that means, although I'm not sure what that matters. Uh, but you get a nice color match between the frame and the slide. A lot of times on these stainless guns, where you have an alloy in the frame and, a, and steel on the slide, there's kind of a little bit of a color mismatch there, so this one avoids that. Small gun. Convenient to carry. No hang-ups today. I don't think I've had any hang-ups with this in quite a while, although uh, some of its ejection was just on my shoulder or even one on top of my head. Uh, not sure what to make of that. Anyway, a nice uh, little 380. Sea Money 1911 with more enthusiasm than skill. That's how it's done.